done it. You did it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Anyways, we are about to pull up to the chiropractor. I'm getting an adjustment and acupuncture done. I've never been to the chiropractor, but I heard that it naturally induces labor. Mind you, I'm only like 39 weeks in one day, but I want this girl to come, okay? Like, we're ready, so... Lies they told are so familiar They will haunt you, they will kill you Keep you hostage, king will heal you Before him, adore him He will give you everything Come and take your Can't keep going, going back To what I used to know Okay. You said what? It wasn't that bad. It was just. So it's been it's been three days since my acupuncture and chiropractor appointment, and your girl still very much pregnant i have been doing literally everything to get this girl to come i've been walking i've been on the stairs i have been on the birthing ball i have been doing okra water i have been doing my dates not as consistently because dates raspberry leaf tea okra water is a lot hopefully she comes tonight please please i'm ready <laughs> what's up y'all so it's january 30th I can't remember the last time I spoke to y'all because I've actually been in a deep depression. You know why? This is why. <laughs> that is why. She's still, why? Why are you still in my tummy and not in my arms? Why? <sighs> so, I've honestly just been trying not to stress about it, even though I was kind of depressed about it. Literally stayed in the bed for like two days, but Thanks to hubby and my daddy, I um, found my groove back and we're back to doing all the remedies and trying all the things. Right now we're getting some food. We've been walking, of course, doing our laps, curb walking, all that good stuff um, around the neighborhood. But I was like, you know what? I'm tired of walking around the neighborhood. I want to go somewhere. Um, I'm thinking about going to this apothecary this lady who makes herbal teas and i think she has like this labor tea that puts you in a labor quick thinking about doing that i've literally thought about doing the castor oil thing haven't tried that yet but i might <laughs> um i just kind of tried to refrain from doing that because there are some side effects some potential side effects that i'm not sure i want to risk um but yeah, so look at him. Look at daddy over there. You look great, babe. Yo, show him the shoes. Show him the kicks real quick. Show him the kicks. Everybody done seen these kicks. Oh, that's crazy. You know why? Because I wear them all the time. Because these shoes are the only thing that fits me right now. <laughs> these sweatpants are all that fits me right now. <laughs> that's why. I'm still a fine model. My size has, my shoe size has literally increased. It's still fine though. We made it to Auntie Peach's Apothecary Herbal Medicine Shop. They are, I already called them, told them that I was coming. So they're expecting me. So we're gonna get this baby out, okay? Mama's ready to eat. Okay. Um, we got our tea. I really want to run. 
rush home and drink it right now. Let's pray over this real quick. Heavenly Father, we pray that this tea is safe and delightful. It brings nothing but smooth, quick labor contractions by midnight tonight. <laughs> Amen. Update, update, update. I am back home and we did a lot after we left the apothecary or auntie peach's apothecary we went and got some ice cream and it was real good and then we went to bj's i'm drinking the tea quick update i have been having contractions um y'all know i drank that tea yesterday i drank it again this morning and then i got a little restless there goes bay in the back Hmm. I got a little restless and this is what I did. Yeah, that's what I did. Um, it was going to be my last resort, but today I was just like, I'm going to do it. Like, I'm going to do it. So right now, it's 1030 at night. January 31st. Um... I'm not, I don't think she's going to come in the next hour and a half. <laughs> I feel like she might be a February 1st baby. Been using this app. The contraction, um, what's it called? What's it called? It's the contraction tag tracker. Um, I've been using this app and so far they've been like between five and, excuse me, 10 minutes apart. Mild to moderate, intense, not too bad, not too bad, okay? I'm just happy that I'm having them because we're so ready to meet, baby. So, I'll keep you guys updated. The contractions have greatly intensified. They have intensified. Um, right now, they're about five to eight minutes apart and I've been contacting my doula and she has been sending me different positions and things to do while I am in labor and I just be like I gotta do all this while I'm feeling like this like that's why I'm sitting on the stairs right now because I was just walking up and down the stairs I've literally been having contractions all night which is crazy to say because i've been waiting for this moment for a long time feels like and it's finally here but yeah these contractions nothing to play with and the crazy thing is is i haven't even peaked i haven't even peaked yet and um that's crazy to me I just had to time that one. Good 55 seconds to a minute. Yeah. 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 Uh, Kylan has been so supportive throughout my laboring process, but also it's been a little, it's been a little funny because this morning I was having contractions and he was like, are you okay? Sir, if you, if you ask me if I'm okay, during your contraction one more time but you know guys just don't understand they will never understand but you know I appreciate him for checking on me I appreciate that no I'm not okay but you know thanks for asking <laughs> Still trying to stay on top of my vitamins. I 
these are the vitamins that I'm taking. Evening Primrose and Prenatal DHA. Just checking in with y'all, letting y'all know that we are almost there. Quick update. Um, contractions are about five minutes apart, and um, my doula is about to come over. <sighs> They're pretty intense for the most part, but you know, we've been we've been getting through them. Okay. Okay. We are still trying to get this baby out. It is 10:27 at night, mm -hmm. February 1st. You started contractions when? Last night. Last night around eight. So right now they seem pretty consistent, but um. We don't know if it'll stay that way. We're hoping it will. We're hoping it will. I'm doing all the things, so. <sighs> stay tuned. Father, to be? Yes. How do you feel right now? I'm uh, excited. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm excited, you know, just uh, taking it step by step, trying to massage her back whenever she has a contraction. Mm -hmm. But don't touch her without her knowing why she's focused because that's mm -hmm. a big no-no. Yeah. I think we've all seen that side. Okay. Um, I'm glad we learned early in one. Yeah. <laughs> Still learning. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah. You ready to have a baby? Yay. <laughs> Nala, how are you feeling about the situation? No comment? Okay.
The further she comes down, just focus on your breathing. You can take quick sips. Can you feel her? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, you feel some hair? Yeah. She's going to have a head full of hair. Good job, good job. Oh, my. Oh, my. Yeah. 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 This is 
Yeah. You looking at me? Looking at me? You see me? You see me?